Well, happy Wednesday, friends. This is Kat Lockler. I just wanted to show you one of our very first projects that we were able to tackle and initiate. We haven't uh, completed it yet, but it is definitely in the works. We are very excited about it. Uh, so one of the most favorite features of our previous home was something that my husband built and is, I think, a must for families with lots of kids is an outdoor shower. And we happen to have a wraparound porch on this house. And uh, one of the interesting, unique things about this house is that you come in from the back, the way it, it arch architecturally is built, is that the front of the house with an entryway and everything is kind of facing our fields. The entryway just has this little platform and it's a perfect place to put a shower. And we looked on Amazon. We also watched YouTube videos of people who installed outdoor showers and we found this portable water heater. Uh, it is hooked up to propane and is battery operated. So batteries just help the ignition, but then that's all they're used for, so they last a lot longer. But we are just testing it out. Yes, it's gonna look very hillbilly-ish right this moment, but it works amazingly well. Uh, this, let me round. This is what we bought. It's called the Camp Lux, uh, and it's a anytime, anywhere, hot water shower system. So we wanted to at least make sure that we could get hot water before we built an outdoor shower area for the kids to shower at. And yes, we have it hooked up uniquely. I'll kind of show you what our vision is for this. And Corey, of course, is, is the mastermind. So bear with me as I try to explain it. But let me get the kids <laughs> clothes out of the way. So this right here is the little platform which technically if this was the front of the house you'd walk in this way knock on the door and come on in for a visit but since this is tech technically it is actually in the back of the house because there's our road and you pull up and you actually enter through the back this is now the back of the house well, that's a lot of talking sorry about that <coughs> sneezy excuse me so this is going to become Instead of an entryway, it's going to be an outdoor shower. This is that little doohickey contraption known as the Camp Lux. And it is pretty fantastic. But it's hooked up to propane. Yes, and you're probably thinking, whoa, that's kind of scary. But we're going to actually put a little um, uh, covered box where this is going to set in. But we wanted to test it to see if it actually worked and worked well. So now that it's hooked up to propane, when there's no water pressure from this guy, you will no, have no heated water. But once you turn this on, listen, you'll hear a click. Hear that click? And now it is 79, 81, 83, 84, and it's just getting hotter and hotter. I'm gonna feel this water. Oh, the water is so warm. It's so warm. So now that we know this gadget is the bomb diggity, look at that, 99 degrees, 101 degrees. I mean, this thing is instantaneously warm and gets warmer by the second. And we're, we have it on minimum gas use. Oops, there we go. So it's not even using very much propane whatsoever. So that is so exciting. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off. Clicking this little button off of here. Shuts everything down. So. This is day one, testing out the heating uh, system, and it works great. So we will keep you informed when we start putting up the corrugated metal and making this pretty fantastic looking. Bye. All right, so this is the makeshift. We put a little shower curtain up, and Corey found this awesome thing for me. So <laughs> it's a bubble bath. I like to look out onto the land. I mean, so cool. It's almost ready, folks. Have a good night.